this is bad. The bleeding isn't stopping. His wound just barely missed his heart. He'd already be dead if it wasn't for that. We should be grateful that Fang charged at his assailant before he could complete his attack. But if we don't do something about this wound... Did we make it in time? Thank goodness. He's still breathing, but barely. Tilt his head. We need him to drink this. Ooh. Oh, you're awake now. I hope you're feeling grateful, Apollonius. From now on, your life belongs to me. So don't go losing it without my permission. I even made sure to write my name on it. I lost consciousness. I heard you were going to the Rudoke Blast Focus. It seems that wasn't a hallucination. We all need to thank us. Just serve us well. The future depends on it. Fight me. No matter how many times you spare my life, I will not falter from this course. Betraying Dorfa and allying with my enemies is out of the question. As long as I still draw breath, I will point my sword at you. You, you stubborn idiot! Your words are meaningless. Now fight! Show me what you got! My turn! New data! Executing. How's this? Brace yourself. Brace yourself. Take this! Huh? My turn! Gun ready! <laughs> Data! Let's go! Found you! I never expected you to be this strong. If this persists, my honor will be sullied. I must risk it all on this single blow. Brace yourself. Take this! Huh? My turn! Still going on about that? Do you know who this amulet belonged to? Spare me your pointless words. Just shut up and listen to me! Your little sister Emily wanted me to give this amulet to you because she couldn't do it herself! W what She... did? There was medicine in here. That's what saved your life! <sighs> it does not matter. She has nothing to do with this. Now fight me again! You bastard! Your sister was worried about keeping you safe! Doesn't that mean anything to you? <sighs> I don't care what you want. I'll defeat you over and over again until you're crying and begging to join my party! <laughs> huh? What's so funny? I'm not sure. I don't fully understand it myself. It's been a long time since I've felt so content. Don't get me wrong. I'm more than willing to fight you for as long as you wish. But I'm choosing not to. Are you gonna run away? No. I'm your enemy, but you saved my life. And despite my ingratitude, you still asked me to join you. This has never happened to me. Does this mean... Yes. I'll become your overseer. 
All right! And, wait, my overseer. Hell no! You're gonna start from the bottom and work your way up, just like everyone else. But that was rather sudden. Earlier, you were so insistent about not betraying Dorfa. It's true. Betraying Dorfa is an unforgivable offense. But the honor and justice displayed by this young man is beckoning my soul to join him. Now that I realize that, the path I must walk is clear to me. So you've fallen in love with me, huh? <laughs> nice. I guess even a bashful pretty boy like you knows how to listen to people. Don't ever call me that again. I hope we get along, Mr. Apollonius. You are older than Fang and I, so you strike me as someone who is very responsible. Especially since Harley is somewhat disappointing. Hey, what's so disappointing about me? Uh, Harley, was it? Please keep your distance from me. I don't want my earthly fire stone. We'll throw a welcome party for Apollonius tonight. I'll show off my full repertoire of cooking techniques. Oh, I want meat! Make a bunch of dishes that are piled high with meat and meat and more meat.